Hello and welcome to story time. I'm so glad that you could join me today. Are you ready for our wiggle worm themes? I miss all you wiggle worms so much. Will you stand up and wiggle with me? You ready? A wiggle wiggle here. A wiggle wiggle there. Wiggle your hands up in the air. Wiggle your shoulders. Wiggle your hips. Wiggle your knees and wiggle your lips. A wiggle, 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 and wiggle some more. And now let's sit down on the floor. Just kidding, one more time, you ready? A wiggle, wiggle here, a wiggle, wiggle there. Wiggle your hands up in the air. Wiggle your shoulders, wiggle your hips. Wiggle your knees and wiggle your lips. A wiggle, 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 and wiggle some more. And now let's sit down on the floor. I brought something special with me today. You wanna guess what they are? <gasps> flowers! Aren't they so beautiful? Do you see all the different kinds of flowers and all the different colors? Mm, they smell so nice. Pretty soon, all the little buds will start popping up and there will be so many spring flowers. My first book that I got with me today, it's called My Garden and it's by Kevin Hankies. So let's take a look and see what we have to say. <gasps> look at that beautiful garden. Isn't that so nice? My mother has a garden. I'm her helper. I water, I weed, and I chase the rabbits away so that they don't eat all the lettuce. It is hard work, and my mother's garden is very nice. But if I had a garden, there would be no weeds, and the flowers would keep blooming and blooming and never die. That would be nice, wouldn't it? In my garden, the flowers could change colors just by my thinking about it. Pink, blue, green, purple, even patterns. Wouldn't that be so cool to be able to change flowers with your mind? And if you picked a flower, another one would grow right back in its place. In my garden, the rabbits wouldn't eat the lettuce because the rabbits would be chocolate and I would eat them. Oh, that would be so silly. If I played planted seashells, I would grow seashells. If I planted jelly beans, I'd grow a great big jelly bean bush. Oh, wouldn't that be fun? Sometimes in my garden, good unusual things would just pop up like buttons and umbrellas and rusty old keys. In my garden there would be birds and butterflies by the hundreds so that the air was humming with wings. The tomatoes would be as big as beach balls and the carrots would be invisible because I don't like carrots. At night, the morning glories would stay open, shining like stars, and the strawberries would grow like lanterns. Oh, it's nighttime now, and only the fireflies and the porch lights are glowing. Before bed, I take one seashell from the shelf in my room and I go to the garden. I poke the seashell into the ground. Who knows what might happen? I cover it up with dirt and I pat down the dirt with my foot. What are you doing? asked my mother. Oh, nothing, I say. Just working in the garden. Well, that was a very fun story, wasn't it? I brought my flannel board with me again today. Can you see how many flowers we have? How many flowers do we have? One, two, three, four, five. Five flowers. 
five spring flowers all in a row. The first one said, we need rain to grow. Has it been raining? Yes, it has. The second one said, oh my, we need water. The third one said, oh, it's getting hotter. The fourth one said, I see clouds in the sky. And the fifth one said, I wonder why. And then, clap, went the thunder and the lightning. That springtime storm was really frightening. But the flowers weren't scared. No, no, no. The rain helped them to grow, grow, grow. That was a fun one, wasn't it? Now, my second book I brought with me is called Bloom, Bloom, and it's by April Pulley Sayer, and it's full of real pictures of flowers. Oh. Every spring across the land, oh, what happens? Oh, the seeds sprout and the stems pop out. They're really pretty flowers, aren't they? <gasps> Look at all those flowers. Bloom. Boom. <gasps> the leaves emerge. See all the leaves? They're very cool, aren't they? And the stalks surge. Oh, <gasps> what's that? What's that? You see what's hiding in there? What is that? <gasps> It's a little bunnies. Bloom. Boom. Oh, what do we have here? Oh, the plants rise. Shapes. Surprise. Have you noticed that all the different flowers are different shapes, aren't they? Oh, bloom. Boom. Oh, the buds. Send and the tips extend. Bloom, boom. Those ones are really bright, aren't they? The buds grow and the blossoms show. See all those little blossoms coming up? Bloom. Petals curve. You see how the petal curves on this one? What's going on over here? Oh, the insect swerve. What kind of an insect is that? Is that a bee? And bees are very important for flowers, aren't they? Because they help carry little bits of the flower. It's all around and help to pollinate. Bloom. Boom. A little bird, welcome birds and butterflies. Oh, what is that? The sun rays warm and the flowers form. Bloom, you ready? Those flowers were really pretty, weren't they? Now, I've got a little scarf song to do, and I brought a scarf with me. But if you don't have a scarf, you could use a bandana, or you could use like a dish towel or a washcloth. So if you wanna pause just for a minute and go get something you can use for your scarf, and then come back and we'll do a fun little scarf song. Are you ready? All right, first we're gonna scrunch it up in our hand. Are you ready? Here is a green leaf, and here is a green leaf. And that, you see, makes two. This is the bud that makes the flower. Now watch it bloom for you. That was really fun, wasn't it? You wanna do it again? All right, scrunch up your scarf. You ready? Here is a green leaf. And here is a green leaf. 
and that you see makes two. This is the bud that makes the flower. Now watch it bloom for you. That was so fun. Let's do it one more time. Are you ready? Here is a green leaf and here is a green leaf. And that you see makes two. This is the bud that makes the flower. Now watch it bloom for you. That was really fun, wasn't it? I hope that you can join me next week. Next week, we're going to talk about birds, and it's going to be very fun. Well, before we say goodbye, let's do our goodbye song. Got your hand out? Are you ready? It is time to say goodbye to all my friends. It is time to say goodbye to all my friends. It is time to say goodbye. Give a smile and wave goodbye. It is time to say goodbye to all my friends. Are you ready? Yeah! Hope to see you next week.